another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about budget-friendly skincare. If you don't have that much to spend, you're not going into department stores, you're not going into, you know, high-end, um, you know, skincare regimes, but you want to go ahead and give yourself the best products that your money can buy, however you know, limited that is. So let's get into it. I've got a couple of them here. If I don't have them here currently, I did bring a couple of them down. If I don't have them, then, you know, then I'll put them up over here somewhere so you guys can see it. Okay. I'm not wearing my contacts today, so I'm going to have to put on my glasses here because I've taken notes. Okay. Um, we're going to be talking about, about, uh, five items. Okay. So I'm not going to stay on too long. It's going to be about five items, budget friendly that you can pick up anywhere and go ahead and start your skincare regime to get your skin into an optimal prime, beautiful, healthy, hydrated skin. So let's get started. Number one is in my opinion, the Neutrogena cleansing okay so we've got uh well we've got two products we've got neutrogena and we've got cerave either of these products depending on your skin type and there's a number of different um neutrogena or cerave products for cleansing for your skin type depending on if you're oily uh normal combination acne or dry okay um the two that i use the first one is the cerave hydrating facial cleanser i absolutely love this this is not going to break the bank it is huge it's about eight fluid ounces um this seriously guys will last you you know six to eight months if not longer i am not kidding you okay um, a little pump goes a long way with this and i don't think it is more than like i don't know i don't think it's double digits honestly i think it's eight maybe eight dollars seven or eight dollars uh at like walgreens cvs um you know drugstore product price i can put up the product price over here somewhere I'll put it up, um, you know, I can certainly do that. And then obviously down in the description box below, I'm going to have all of these products listed with a link so you guys can go right up to, you know, whether it's Target or Ulta or Walgreens or wherever it is or Walmart, um, there will be a link up to these products. I, I don't get, you know, anything. I'm like affiliated pennies on the dollar for like a thousand clicks. So it's not like I'm getting any money off of this, but you know, I'm just doing it for convenience sake, you know, to, to have these links up there. Okay. Um, the other one is the Neutrogena Ultra Gentle Daily Cleanser. Now this one, I really like guys, if you are doing any kind of uh, let's say retin-A procedure, retinoid procedure, maybe uh, derma rolling, although I've never done derma rolling, anything that requires an ultra, ultra gentle cleanser, a cleanser that no matter what is not going to um, make you suffer as far as skincare is or as far as, uh, you know, outbreaks or dermatology or anything like that, this is the type of product that you can use no matter what. And there's David going around getting things out of our dining room. So ignore the man behind the curtain. Wave, David. <laughs> so he's waving there. Okay, so that's number two. Let me go ahead and uh, get you number... Oh, that's number one, cleansers. Okay, number two is... Um, do-it-yourself sugar scrubs. Now, for exfoliating, you know, you can go to like a Walgreens or a CVS, and for the most part, you will be able to get like one of these Freeman um, scrubs. Uh, they could be the, the uh, not tar, what is it called? Mud, mud or tar, I can't, I can't remember. Uh, the black, maybe it's black charcoal. That's what it is, black charcoal. Uh, scrubs for like $4.99 or $5.99 and again I'll put it up here you know so you can see it uh, if not you could guys you can do your own scrubs this it's not going to break the bank okay 
All you have to do is buy, now I like to buy raw sugar cane, so brown, raw, organic sugar cane, sugar, you know, regular sugar in a packet. And then all you need is some sort of oil emollient. You can have uh, liquid coconut oil if it's the one that stays liquidy um, in, you know, during during all times. It's not the one that gets hard or anything like that. The one that stays liquefied all times. That could run you a little bit. If not, go ahead, go to Kroger or Publix or whatever. Get yourself some extra virgin olive oil, okay? All you have to do, I kid you not, get like a little, um, you know, Tupperware or a little tub or a little whatever cream little thing even wash out an old cream jar anything like that a little jar go ahead and put in some of your raw sugar and then uh go ahead and put in enough olive oil to make it moist okay you don't want to make it watery like very very moist but you want to make it moist enough where you could scoop up enough into the palm of your hands wet your face with warm water um you know, warm to hot water, not, not scalding, obviously, but, you know, enough to open up your pores and then scoop up some of that uh, sugar, olive oil. You can also put some uh, vitamin E capsules in there, squirt it in there. You can put rose hip, whatever you want as far as your oil content. Scoop it up and gently exfoliate your face with the raw sugar. The raw sugar is going to take and exfoliate your skin. It's got the um, just all these wonderful ingredients to help exfoliate gently. You know, you don't want to rub it in very, very harshly. Gently with the oil. The oil is going to um, help it slip all across your face. And then go ahead, take a warm washcloth, a moist, warm washcloth, put it on your face like that, and then just go ahead and uh, take off the entire scrub. Your face will thank you so much. Your face will be absolutely amazingly soft, amazingly gorgeous. And again, pennies, pennies. It costs you pennies. You know, a jar of, and you can get the small jar of um, olive oil. You don't have to have the, the big jar of olive oil because it only takes a very little amount, maybe two or three uh, tablespoons to get that uh, sugar soaked where you can use it, okay? So sugar is inexpensive. Olive oil is not that expensive. You can have your scrub and the olive oil and the vitamin E keeps it fairly antibacterial. So you can have it in that jar for a long time. You can have it two, three, four months in that jar, keep using it and believe me, it's wonderful. Okay, uh, moving on to number three is the Nivea cream. Again, this is something that you can pick up for, you know, four or five dollars, maybe six dollars. The big tub, you can even get the small tub for like, I don't even know, two ninety nine or something. Lasts forever. This is an all around wonderful cream. You can use it uh, at night. You can use it on your elbows, your hands, the back of your hands, uh, obviously on your face, your neck, your decollete. You can just go to town with this. It lasts a long time. You need a very small amount. It's a very thick type of cream. So, you know, just dot it over here, you know, on your areas and your nose, maybe a little bit under your eye, and you just massage it in. It is wonderful, guys. Absolutely wonderful, budget friendly. This, I've had this for, um, I think almost a year now, almost a year. Don't use it every day you know, that's true. But the small amounts that it takes to moisturize your, you know, your elbows, hands, even your feet, whatever, whatever body parts that you want, this thing will last a very, very long time. Okay. So that's that one. Um, okay. The other one, number four is the AHA cream. Uh, again, this is something that you can pick up whoop, there you go. You can pick up for, you know, six, $7, uh, $8. It's 
does not break the bank. It is actually a Walgreens product. It's their branding. It's called Studio 35 Beauty. And it's alpha hydroxy acid, which um, is beneficial for exfoliating your face. Now, again, you know, if you're doing the sugar, you might not want to do this, you know, right away or the next day. But in lieu of your sugar scrub, you can use this uh, as a nightly cream. You just leave it on overnight and it just um, gently, gently, I, I hate to say eats away your skin, but it does. It just... <sighs> It just takes away those dead skins. I don't know how it does it, okay? I don't know how it eliminates it. But when you wash your face the next morning, your face is amazing. It is so soft. It is so radiant. It is so beautiful. Um, I've never had any, any ill effects. I've never had any breakouts from it. It's just an absolutely wonderful cream. And you, you know, it's one of these unsung heroes, honestly, an unsung hero. Okay, um, number five is masking. Masking, awesome stuff, okay? You don't have to break the bank. You don't have to get, you know, uh, Peter Thomas Roth's 24 karat gold mask for 80, 90, or $100. You don't have to. You can get amazing masks at, um, you know, again, department store, or not department, um, CVS, Walgreens, um, all of these stores, Walmart has them, Ulta has them, Sephora has them. And the ones that I like that are my favorites are the ones in, you know, that come in packets. You can even get them if you go to any um, Asian market. If you have an Asian market around your house and you get your food or, you know, fruit or whatever. Asian markets have tons of masking. They are known for their masking. Uh, I've already tried a diamond mask. I have a video on that one. It was phenomenal. Uh, this is one that I picked up at Five Below, one of my favorite stores. They have pearl, aqua, water, blah, blah, blah. You can get them for $2. Some The Asian markets are uh, 10 masking packets. I kid you not, for $10. So a dollar for a masking packet. Uh, I've had things from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Again, you know, um, I have one that's the rose hip mask that I talk about in another video. And again, I can link, link it below. Um, that is like, I think seven masks for like $7 and 50 cents or something, 75 cents a mask. I mean, outrageously cheap, outrageously. If you do masking, um, I do it about once a week. Some people are known to do it twice or more. There are some beauty gurus here that um, that absolutely uh, live by it and do it nightly. I think it's a little bit overkill on my skin. My skin type doesn't need it every single day. But, you know, use your judgment at a dollar or a dollar fifty a mask. See how you like it and definitely, you know, pick that up because that is worth it on a budget. Okay. Um, and then the last thing I want to show you, uh, for a budget is a retinoid or a retinoid cream that you can get. You don't have to spend hundreds of dollars for your prescription retin A. If you cannot do anything else, you will go ahead and go to Walgreens or, or CVS or Walmart has it. Um, major, all the major stores has it now. Is the different gel cream. Hopefully this will come in. Come on, guys. Bring it in. Bring it in. Uh, it is Adapalene. I don't know why it's not coming in right now, but it's Adapalene. And it is... Um, 0.1%. So there you go. 0.1% different gel. And uh, it's labeled as an acne treatment, but uh, everybody and their mother knows that it's an anti-wrinkle, anti-aging retinoid type of treatment. You put a tiny bit, bit on. I'm not going to go through demonstrations here. I've got uh, videos that show you how to use it. Just go ahead and uh, search on um, Adapalene or Differin in my uh, video list and you will hit on it. You will see how to use it. I talk all about it and how to use it and when to use it and everything like that. But you cannot, um, you cannot, 
go around the fact that for the bang for the buck, this is one of the best creams that you can buy for anti-aging, okay? It might, it, it, ha, it, um, it activates certain uh, cells uh, underneath your skin and um, they call them alpha and beta cells and blah, 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 blah. Uh, retin A or, you know, retinoid creams activate other types of cells and this activates another type of cell. But in combination, if you use both of them, and again, I have videos that, that uh, show you how to do that, um, you are covering your basis. You're basically covering all the different types of um, cells in your skin and your, you know, epidermis or, or sub, you know, subdermis that uh, are going to go ahead and benefit from this type of cream. I know it sounds, it sounds kind of crazy to, to under, you know, to do that. But, um, if you can't, uh, get any other form of a retinoid cream is what I'm saying. If your budget only allows, you know, 10 or $15 for an anti-aging cream that has retinol retinoid in it, different is my number one pick. Okay. I hope that makes sense. If you can get prescription strength retinoid creams, then obviously you would get a Retin-A cream and you would get that from your doctor and you would get a prescription. Not, But not everybody can get a prescription. I, for one, uh, I can get a prescription, but I am not covered as far as anti-aging. So if I go um, to the pharmacy with my prescription that my doctor gave me, it is still going to cost me $350 or $380 for a tube of Retin-A. That's the reality, okay? So to make ends meet, I do incorporate different. Now, I have I have a workaround for getting Retin-A on the cheap. And again, I can put that in a link below uh, and tell you guys how to do that. You basically have to order it outside of the country. And, uh, you know, most of the people do have luck with it. Um, you know, use your own discretion if you want to, you know, try that method out. I will leave a link below. But uh, if you can't do anything else, pick up different. It is going to amaze you. It is absolutely going to amaze you. Okay. And I think that is it. Yes, those are my five. And I'm sorry, I'm cheating with my glasses today because I don't have my contacts in. I had a rough day today with my contacts. My I didn't even put in my contacts. My eye was just absolutely being attacked. Uh, I think I put on some sunscreen that I normally, it doesn't get into my eyes. For some reason, it got into my eye and um, I was tearing for most of the day till I basically, uh, you know, washed off my skin once I came home for the day and washed it off. And now my, my you know, eyes are kind of calming down, but... It was, it was rough today, so I'm in, completely in glasses, okay? No makeup, nothing, zero. This is it. This is the way it's going to be for today, so it's, it is it. Um, I love you guys very much. Thank you so much for joining me and for um, listening to this. I hope this was helpful for you guys, and I hope that you uh, go ahead and pick up some of these budget-friendly items. I think they are worth every penny. Uh, they are great and I can't recommend them enough. Now, um, just FYI, uh, I went ahead and did my nails today and I know I shortened them. They're usually a little bit, um, a little bit longer than this, but check this out. This is, uh, by Essie and I'm going to tell you what it is. It is the color ballerina. In fact, I have it here. Um, ballet slippers. I don't know if you can see these, this guys. I'm gonna try to put it in here. Uh, I don't think you're gonna see it. Okay, but it's called Ballet Slippers and it's a 096 and it's Essie. It's a beautiful, beautiful light pink color, baby pink color. And supposedly, this is the big rumor mill, is that uh, Meghan Markle is the one that is wearing this now as part of her new regime allowance. She is allowed to wear only light colors, according to the queen. 
The queen says that only light, pristine, pinky uh, nails are allowed for immediate uh, royal family. And they must be, um, you know, uh, short. So, you know, I got my short nail. I'm, I'm rocking my royal nails today, okay? So these are my royal nails, and I'm rocking my royal nails today. I'm sorry if it's not coming in. Oh, come on, dude. You know what? Hang on a second. Let me go ahead and take off my auto focus. And then if I take that off, I will be able to show you guys. Hang on. Uh, okay, let me put it over here and let me focus in. There you go. Now, I know I didn't do the best job in coloring. I am not a great colorer and they, the color is a little bit, um, it goes on a little bit patchy. And again, I'm not the best at doing my own nails. I, I plan to do, bring this into a nail salon and get it done. And I know I kind of maybe color it out of the corners a little bit, but that is the color. It is a beautiful pink color. I'm really liking it, guys. So I uh, just wanted to pass that along to you guys. Oh, let me put the, my auto back on here. Just wanted to pass it along to you guys. Again, if you want to go ahead and pick that up, that is endorsed by the Queen of England. So you go ahead and get that if you want to rock the royal vibes uh for your nails okay i love you guys very much i hope you enjoyed this video you know everything is tongue tongue in cheek as far as uh that's concerned with um you know megan and uh the queen and everything like that i love you guys very much thank you for supporting me please subscribe and give it a thumbs up a big fat thumbs up and uh share this video to all your friends and neighbors and cohorts and co-workers and everybody else that uh, you know you deem fit and I don't know why my my lights are going down again Ugh, I think I'm draining my batteries and stuff but it's time for dinner and David as you saw snuck in here to uh, get stuff get stuff out of our china cabinet and he's setting up dinner for me so that I am allowed to talk with you guys till the last minute before you know dinner is on and uh, that's it I love you guys very much and I will see you in my next video bye